Hi guys, you're watching Tuesdays with Expression on Cards TV. This is Mary, and I've already done today's project, and it turned out so stinking cute. I can't wait to show it to you. I used the Doodle Charms cartridge, the Artiste cartridge, Winter Woodland, and for my sentiment, I used Cards TV, Holly Jolly, and I used No Peeking. Now let me show you what I've already put together from the Artiste cartridge. It turned out so cute. I just love this little box. And it takes no glue to put this box together. And you can see it's held together right up here by these tabs. So let me show you where to find this. This is in the Artiste cartridge on page 37. Here it is right here. And the suggested size is 4 inches. And that's what I cut it at. I don't think you could cut it any bigger than that because of the width of it. And you can see it looks like it would be hard to put together, but it is super easy. And of course the Cricut always puts little notches where all the score lines are. So you just go ahead and score it, and it goes together real easily. And if you have the Artiste cartridge, you know there's another manual that comes with it that tells you exactly how to put all the boxes and everything together that are in the Artiste cartridge. Now, I cut this out of craft, as I said, at 4 inches. I've covered the end panels and the front and the back with some red cardstock and then I found this cute plaid this is from Recollections and I cut the mat out of that and put it on here too and that makes this box a little bit more sturdy and I've tied some red and white maraschino baker's twine up here at the top just to hold it together because it says no peeking so you know if that bow's untied somebody's looked <laughs> And they're not supposed to. They're supposed to wait till Christmas. Now, the reindeer came from the Doodle Charms cartridge. On page 126, I cut the back of the reindeer, this part right here, out of some dark brown. This was out of some more craft, and his nose was out of red. Now, I took a piece of black and put behind the two holes that the Cricut cuts for the eyes so that they would be darker than this dark brown. And can you see his little hoofs down here? I wanted it to look like he was peeking, <laughs> since I said no peeking. Oh, and I cut him at three and a half inches. But what I did for his little hoofs down here is I took a half inch circle punch. I punched one circle out of the craft and one out of black. And before I adhered them together, I just took my scissors and cut just a little pie shape out of the black and then put it on top of the craft and it looks like little reindeer hoofs doesn't it now these are popped up on foam tape as is the reindeer and I don't know if you can see it but I took my wink of Stella clear brush marker I went over his nose because he's Rudolph and I also went over his antlers just to give it some sparkle and shine now for the holly and the berries I used Winter Woodland, and you'll find those on page 41. And I cut the holly right here and these berries at one inch. These berries have uh, the clear wink of Stella on them. And then I took this Jelly Roll Stardust marker and just traced all around the edge of the holly leaves and down the center. And I think that turned out so, so cute. And it was so quick and easy. You could put a gift card in here. You could put candy, cookies, jewelry would be good. <laughs> It'd be good to get this with jewelry, wouldn't it, guys? But I love the way it turned out. And I hope if you guys have the Artiste cartridge, you'll give this a try. It's just the cutest little box. And like I said, it takes no glue. It just all folds, and it's held together by these two tabs right here. They just go right across. It's got these little slits. And then just to keep it secure, 
You can tie it up or not. It's strictly up to you. So there's my project for today's Tuesdays with Expression. I hope you guys enjoyed this. And I will see you again soon with card number, I think it's 11 in the 12 Days of Christmas card series. Oh, and I forgot to tell you guys, all the Christmas stamps, the fall stamps, and the Halloween stamps will be shipping to me this week. So the rain check sale is coming soon, guys. So keep your eyes and ears open because I'm going to let you know before it happens so you don't miss out this time and you can pick up that favorite stamp set that you've been trying to get. So thanks again for stopping by. I'll see you again soon. Bye now.